Okay, I have extremely, I would say extremely good memory. Even remember what somebody was wearing on a certain day at a certain year. Uh, I can usually remember what somebody said at a certain time. Uh, obviously, it uh, helps out quite a bit in this career when it comes to, you know, when you're working against the clock. I would describe myself as somebody who's uh, social and outgoing. I uh, can be considered that friend that people go to to talk to and things of that nature. Somebody who's reliable and communicates very effectively. I'm passionate about my family, passionate about travel, passionate about the sports teams uh, that I root for, of course passionate about the storytelling and uh, the career that I'm privileged to do that I've always wanted to do and certainly enjoy that. 100% breakfast guy, I do believe that is the most uh, important meal of the day. I like to get a big hearty breakfast because I know I'm going to be busy throughout the rest of my day. Uh, I typically like to start with some eggs, a side of potatoes, some hot sauce as well to get my proteins and a good balance of carbs going. Uh, it gives me the energy I need uh, throughout the day. Oh, I have many, but uh, I'll start with my biggest one, I would say Carrie Underwood. I remember the Titans, I'm a huge football fan like most people are here in Texas. Uh, I never get tired of that anytime I see it on TV or if I just wanna watch it on the Disney app, you know, Denzel Washington's always got those many motivational quotes in there. It's a great storytelling, great visuals. Uh, obviously the movie resonates with me in many ways, so I never get tired of Remember the Titans. Definitely, I would say, Californication by the Red Hot Chili Peppers. Uh, they're also one of my favorite bands. Uh, music, I'm into all sorts of music, uh, all different genres. Uh, Love country, love uh, hip hop, of course, love rap. If you look at my Spotify playlist, that's primarily what you're gonna see. Supersonic speed, because I can live and fulfill my lifelong dream of being in the NFL, and I would be a receiver that way. I'd be the fastest receiver on the field. Before I moved to Houston, my family, my dad was working in New Orleans at the time. We were uh, part of the evacuees during Hurricane Katrina. Uh, Houston took us in. Uh, you know, made us feel like home and family. That's why it's special to me. That's also part of the reason why I got into news. I saw the reporters and anchors and field crews out there just sharing stories and interviewing people and broadcasting it uh, during a really difficult time in our country. And being part of uh, that group um, is always something that, something that sticks with me and I'm, I'll have to talk about till this day.